Oh my god, the moment she showed up on the show. <laughs> Thank you.
So I challenged myself to use the X-Carve and its full cutting surface area to see if I can come up with a design that would utilize the whole surface to make one piece of furniture. This way you only put one piece of material in, set the cut path, and then you get out a finished piece of furniture. This is a simple stool design, not quite as dynamic as most of my other stuff, but I was really just trying to get a little bit more involved with the machine, understand its parameters, understand its cutting ability. This cutting path took about two hours. If I change the cutting speed and the cutting feed and adjust the actual bit, I'm sure I can get that down to under an hour. But this is a piece of Baltic birch. It's multi-layered. It has no voids in it. It looks nice when you paint the open edge and it's a little bit hard to cut. So that's why I slowed it down. If you did this design out of MDF or maybe some sort of foam core material, I'm sure you could speed it up considerably. And I set my cutting depth really shallow because I was afraid that I might break the bit in this harder material. Well, there it is. It's not one of my most beautiful designs, but it is very practical and it is very strong. This whole layout will be up on the Inventables website. You can download the file yourself, play with it, adjust it, modify it, make it better. But there you go. The challenge, design a piece of furniture that fits inside the 31 by 31 inch cutting table. Thanks for watching.